everyone, I'm Paloma from Bucklover Paloma, and today I'm going to be doing a book haul. So, it was my birthday recently, like on April 21st, and I got a bunch of books for my birthday. So, I decided why not do a book haul? So, here I am doing a book haul on all the books I got for my birthday. But the first books I got, I got them before my birthday, and I got these at Costco because I saw them there, so my dad bought them for me. And so, these books are. The Haters by Jesse Andrews, and this book, I already read this book because I, I got it right before my birthday, so I had to read it already, and it's an amazing book. And at first, I didn't really know what it was about going into it, but I absolutely loved it, like, at the end. So, The Haters by Jesse Andrews. Read it, especially if you love me and Nala Dying Girl, then read this book. And then the other book I bought at Costco is this um, Demigods and Magicians by Rick Riordan. And it's just a collection of the three um, mini short stories um, where Annabeth meets Daddy and Carter meets Percy. And, like, you know, when they finally meet. And so I already read them. I, I bought them on my iPad, you know, in ebook form. But I just had to have them, like, in book form. And then it has a sneak peek of Rick Riordan's new book, The Hidden Oracle. And I just can't wait for that book to come out. It's almost here. It's almost here. Just, like, a week left. So I'm really, really, really excited. And then the last book my dad bought for me at Costco was this book called Rainy Nightingale. And I have no idea what this book's about. I just saw it and it looked interesting. And so I bought it. Or my dad bought it for me. And so I just read the back, which says Three Girls One Summer, a friendship that changed their lives. So I'm like, ooh, contemporary novel. I haven't read one of those in like the longest time. Like I really haven't. And so I just picked it up and I just bought it. I have no idea what it's about. So those are the three books I got at Costco. And then these next books are the ones that came in the mail because I ordered them on Amazon. And I'm just going to do paperback first and hardcover. So that's what I'm going to do. So the books that I got, the first one is The Dream Thieves by Maggie Stifader. Can't say that. And it's the second book in the Raven Cycle. And I read the first one back in January. And I didn't have any of the other books. So I decided I'll get the books because I already read the first one. So I got the Dream Thieves and I also got Blue Lily Lily Blue. And so I have the first, the second, and third book now. And yeah, I can't wait to read these. And then I need to buy the fourth one because it comes out April 26th. And so I need to buy that one after I finish reading these because I need to read the series because I only read the first book. So yeah. Then I also bought another series, like all the, the all the books in the series, and it's a trilogy, and that series is the Grisha trilogy, and so I bought Shadow and Bone, Siege and Storm, and Ruin and Rising. So I bought all these three books. Can't wait to read this series, because I've heard amazing things about the series, and it's by Leigh Bardugo. And to have now have all these three books. And so I'm going to read them as soon as I can. And I don't, I also don't know what these books are about. I just heard great things about them. So that's why I picked them. That's the only reason why I picked them. Because I heard amazing things about this book. So I bought a lot of books that I have like no idea what they're about. The next book that I got was Unravel Me by Taryn Mappy. And this is the second book in the Shatter Me trilogy. And I have the first book that I read back in January. And I had the third book, but I didn't have the second book. So I'm like, I have the first and third book, but not the middle book. So I just, so I had to buy it just so I could finish the series because I want to finish it. And I just love the covers of these books. Like the eye is just beautiful. Look at the eye. Isn't it just beautiful? And yeah, it's amazing and it's beautiful. And the next paperback book is one I really, really, really want to read. And it's a movie and it's, that's coming out in summer. I don't know. I forgot which month. And I really want to read this book. So that's why I bought it. And that book is Me Before You by Jojo Moyes. And I saw the trailer for Me Before You. And it, like, my heart was, like, dying. Because, like, it was just so cute and romantic. And I'm just like, I need to read this book. And so I bought the book. So I could read it before I see the movie because that's what I always do. And so I just can't wait to read this book because it's I just seen the trailer. I just like it just seems so cute and romantic. And so like I 
really can't wait to read this book until maybe for you. Probably like the first book I read because like this I don't know, I just feel like I I just feel like I need to read this book like right now. And then the next book I got was Ready Player One by Ernest Klein. There's his name, there's his name, I couldn't find it. And I've heard amazing things about this book. I read the prologue, it's really interesting, and I can't wait to read this one. Ready Player One. And the last paperback book that I got is actually a book I have to read for my history class. And so this book is probably going to be the first one that I'm going to read because I have to write an essay on it that's due like May 9th, which is coming up and I haven't done anything. So I need to stop procrastinating because I'm a big procrastinator. But that book is Catch-22 by Joseph Heller. And this is a huge book. I did not think it was going to be this huge. And you read it, write an essay on this by May 9th. And yeah, I'm gonna fail that class. And then the letter are so tiny too. So yeah, I just got this book because I had to read it, and it seems interesting. It's just I have to read it for school, which I don't really like reading books for school because when I read books for school, they seem less interesting for some reason. For some reason, they do. So those were all the paperback books that I bought, and then I also bought a few hardcovers, but not a lot, like only like a few, because hardcovers are expensive. So the first hardcover book that I got was Yellow Brick War, the third book in the Dorothy Must Die series, and I love the Dorothy Must Die series, like the first book was amazing, the second book, it was good, but it wasn't as amazing. And now there's Yellow Brick War, and then there's going to be a fourth book in the series, too. So I'm just really, really excited. But I swear, the books are getting smaller and smaller. Look how small this is. I remember the first one was really huge, the second one was small, and now this one's, like, even smaller. So why are the books getting smaller and smaller? Aren't they supposed to be getting bigger and bigger? But, yeah, I'm really excited to read this one because I just love this series so much. Like, I just love this series a lot. The next hardcover book that I got was Untamed by A.G. Howard, and this is part of a series called the Splinter Series, and if you haven't heard of that series, it's basically a retelling of Alice in Wonderland, and I love Alice in Wonderland, like, I just love Wonderland, anything that has to do with Wonderland, anything at all, and I can't wait till the new movie, Alex Through the Looking Glass, comes out, and so... This is basically like a bunch of novellas about like the, the books and the books in the series are splintered, unhinged, and ensnared. And they're really good books. Like I didn't think I was going to like them, but I absolutely love them. And so if you haven't read, heard of this series, I really think you should read them. And then what I like most about this is the letters, the words, you can't really see because right now, but the words are in a different color ink. They're not black. In this one, they're blue. And then the other books are like red and green and like blue again, I think. But I just love this, these books. They're just so wonderful and like full of Wonderland things. <laughs> okay, and then the last book, this is the last book I got. And so I was, a, I was sad it was only a few books, even though these are like a lot of books. But the last book I got is a really, really popular book that I've been wanting to read. And that book is Six of Crows by Ray Bardugo. And so this takes place in the land of the Grisha trilogy, I'm pretty sure. And so I can't wait to read this book because, like, I've heard so many great things about this book. So, yeah, and it's huge and the cover's pretty. The cover's really pretty. And, yeah, the dust jacket. And look. It's black. I love it. It's black. Like my soul. I'm just kidding. My soul is in black. So, Six of Crows. Can't wait to read this book. I'm going to read it after I finish um, reading the Grisha trilogy. So, yeah. So, those were the books I got. And those, how many books were those? Um, let me count them. Just wait a second. Let me count them. 15 books. 15 books. I got 15 books that's a lot of books not a lot but 
good enough. And so that was my birthday book haul. And those were all the books I got for my birthday. But I'll be coming back with another book haul with books that I bought with the money I got for my birthday. Yeah. Oh, and that's not the only thing I got for my birthday. I didn't just get books. My big present that I got for my birthday was a new camera. So I got this new camera. It's a Canon um, Rebel T5. Um, my dad just bought it for me. And I love him for doing this because I'm getting into photography and videoing. And so um, I'll be taking photography class during the summer. And so like I have my new camera right here. And I opened the box. You can see, but I haven't like, taken anything out from inside because I'm afraid I'm going to break it because I break almost everything I touch. But look at all the stuff I have inside. Oh, and so yeah. So that was like my big birthday present that I got. So that was like really, really, really excited to get this. So that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching my birthday book haul. And hope you guys have a wonderful day. And so thank you for watching. I'm Paloma from Book Paloma. And like and subscribe for more videos. Bye.